Good morning, everybody. My name is Daniel Pillow, coming to you here from First Presbyterian Church in Covington, Virginia, starting out on this Thursday morning on this first day of August with a reading from Matthew chapter 28, verse 1 through 10. After the Sabbath, as the first day of the week was dawning, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary went to see the tomb. And suddenly there was a great earthquake, for an angel of the Lord, descending from heaven, came and rolled back the stone and sat on it. His appearance was like lightning, and his clothing white as snow. For fear of him, the guards shook and became like dead men. But the angel said to the women, Do not be afraid. I know that you are looking for Jesus, who is crucified. He is not here, for he has been raised, as he said. Come see the place where he lay. Then go quickly and tell his disciples he has been raised from the dead, and indeed he is going ahead of you to Galilee. There you will see him. This is my message for you. So they left the tomb quickly with fear and great joy and ran to his disciples. Suddenly Jesus met them and said, Greetings, and they came to him, took hold of his feet, and worshipped him. Then Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers to go to Galilee. There they will see me. And that is our reading today from Matthew. If you will, please join me now in a time of prayer together. Let us now pray together. Dear Lord, may nothing separate us from you today. Teach us how to choose only your way today so each step will lead us closer to you. Help us walk by the word and not our feelings. Help us to keep our hearts pure and undivided. Protect, Protect us from our own careless thoughts, words, and actions. And keep us from being distracted by our wants, our desires, and our thoughts on how things should be. Help us to embrace what comes our way as an opportunity rather than a personal inconvenience. Keep us and our families safe, please, at all times, Lord, especially those who may be in transit this morning. For these things we pray in Christ's name. Amen. Thank you all for joining me here this morning. Hope to see you here tomorrow morning as well. Hope you all have a wonderful first day of August today.